Hi everyone, this is Gary Now. In today's video, we're going to walk through how KeyFactor can discover and monitor TLS endpoints for new and expiring certificates. All it takes is one expired certificate to cause a wave of failures that can lead to a massive outage. Ultimately, expiring certificates are the enemy of uptime. So let's jump into the portal and take a look at how KeyFactor can help you identify and avoid these certificate-based outages. SSL discovery is based on defined networks. Each network will spawn a new SSL discovery and monitoring job that allows administrators the flexibility to segment their network to optimize performance. So let's define a new network. We'll give this network a name and a description. Next, we'll select an orchestrator pool. KeyFactor installs with a default pool that contains all orchestrators registered with the SSL scanning capability. Custom orchestrator pools can be defined to allow separation of scanning duties based on the orchestrator's location. Next, we'll define our schedule. Discovery jobs search for new certificates and will touch every endpoint within the network definition. Monitoring jobs look at existing certificates marked included for monitoring and will alert based on the configured expiration threshold defined in the advanced tab. We'll also define a recipient for notifications. And let's move on to the advanced tab. Under the scanning section, we can enable or disable the scanning for this network. We can also define if we want to automatically add certificates found through discovery to be monitored. And finally, we can set whether or not we want KeyFactor to request the robot.txt file. This adds a web crawler-like access pattern to the scan job and may be more successful. We can change some of our timeout settings as well as set our notification alerts. Next, we'll define our network to be scanned. We have three options for defining a network. We can add it via network notation or CIDR. We can add individual IP addresses or individual host names. I'm gonna go ahead and add my local network. You can also add port ranges and the details pane will dynamically update. We'll add our range, we'll validate that it's a valid network range. And we can also define quiet hours. Quiet hours are a window where SSL scanning will not execute. This allows us to exclude specific time ranges to further optimize when and how our scans are executed. When complete, we'll save our scan and we'll see that it is now currently scheduled. I have an existing job that is already run, so let's take a look at what the results of a scan looks like. When we select the view network endpoints, we'll see everything that was found under our particular scan. If we double click a DNS entry, we'll get the details of the TLS endpoint We'll get some details about the certificate itself and which jobs that certificate was found in. If we return to our certificate search, all certificates that were imported will be tagged with a location that shows them as being found during an SSL scan. We can go into the locations menu and see which scan and which paths that that certificate has been found. That's it. That's how KeyFactor can help you avoid a certificate-based outage by using our SSL scanning to import certificates from your TLS endpoints.